Hey, hey y'all, what you doing? I was just sitting here. I am just drank my coffee and ate my muffins and stuff that I do in the afternoon. And I just been having a good day and I hope y'all are too, so. Let's see, let's ask the eight ball a question, okay? This is for, this is for the um, the younger people. Um, are you going to get married in the next year? Very doubtful. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's ask another question. Is COVID a real thing or is it just like really not nothing? Very doubtful. Oh, so it's not. Mm. Um, anyways, so I just like to think about stuff. I like to think about simulation theory and things like that, you know, to keep my mind wandering because I feel like life should be wander, should be something to kind of play around with, you know, to check it out and not just go through your routine but to kind of peek through the veil of reality and uh, see what it's all about <clears throat> and the reason I feel like there are things to see is because I've had experiences myself in which you wouldn't call natural or you might call supernatural but to me everything is natural because whatever's here is just here even if it's a factory or you know crazy technology it's natural because it came from this place that we're in maybe we're there's infinite dimensions that we just skip to every now and again and maybe we get distracted by things while we're skipping through dimensions who knows I don't know I just like to read about stuff like that and kind of think about how cool that is, you know, all the infinite possibilities and stuff like that just makes me happy. <laughs> so what makes you happy? What makes you happy? Because I don't take nothing, you know, seriously except for, you know, when it comes to my kids now. Or my dog. I had to jump on a pit bull the other day because it jumped on my dog and tried to kill it. But I jumped on her and squeezed her. I still got like messed up knees and stuff, Ugh. elbows, and it was. But you know, gotta do what you gotta do. Anyway, so y'all, I just take it one day at a time because you don't never know. But I think it'd be cool if we could learn how to look within our own selves and you know just find that one thing that we're searching for that deep meaningful thing that's probably easy to find when you're not seeking so diligently that will bring us forth into a whole new feeling an excitement like we've never known before that will give us insight insight into secrets that we shall never tell because words cannot explain these things this we're all just reaching reaching for that spiritual something to awaken us I don't know but you know I stay happy. I stay happy. We're just going to go on a little miniature vacation. And so I'm excited about that. you got to get excited about stuff, you know. You've got to stay excited about stuff. Even the little things. Find stuff to be excited about. You know, go buy you some seeds and plant you some stuff. And get excited when you start seeing them grow. You know, I got excited when I started seeing my little radish and stuff pop up. Shoot. And my zucchini then got big from seeds. Which I've never been able to grow stuff from seeds before now. But anyways, I just want to say I love you all guys and and just, you know, get excited. It's time. Love you. Bye.